Hi, I'm Larry Karaszewski and this is Trailers from Hell. Director Michael Winner and tough guy Charles Bronson made six pictures together, and this one's the best of the bunch. From 1972, The Mechanic, co-starring Jan Michael Vincent. Charles Bronson, the number one box office star in the world. Charles Bronson was an actor of limited range, but he had a huge screen presence. He is riveting to watch. The first 10 minutes of The Mechanic is silent. Bronson doesn't need words. In fact, he's probably better without them. Think of the iconic way Sergio Leone uses him in Once Upon a Time in the West. He just owns the screen. Now this trailer from The Mechanic is from a reissue campaign with a different title. I guess The Mechanic was too subtle. People showed up at the theater expecting Bronson to be working on cars. So they slapped on a new title, Killer of Killers, which wrongly tries to paint him as some kind of avenging angel. Maybe it was to cash in on the success of Death Wish, where he did play a killer of killers. No, in The Mechanic, he is just a killer, a hitman. He makes no moral judgments. He's an existential hero living by his own code. That's what makes The Mechanic interesting. The film is a procedural. It shows you step by step how a high-end hitman does his job. No emotions, just a lot of research. And strangely for a Bronson movie, not that much action. That's what surprised me the last time I watched it. In the 70s, it was considered a shoot 'em up exploitation picture, but by today's standards, it's an art film, a character study. To get away with it, it depends on the book of rules you have in your pocket at the time. One of the trolls of the trade, my friend. Hell, it would play Sundance. A lot of the credit for that has to go to the quality of the screenplay. It's an intelligent, clever script by Louis John Carlino. He made some terrific movies, the John Frankenheimer Rock Hudson film Seconds, The Great Santini, a smart Ellen Burstyn film called Resurrection. In The Mechanic, he's come up with a doozy of an ending, a great final twist. I don't want to give any more away, just see The Mechanic. Killer of Killers.